the final presentation of our Lamo Today Special Value. They are suede, whether you choose the short that you're seeing on screen now or the taller, which I'll show you in a second. This is our last Lamo TSV of the year and our only Lamo TSV of the year. And if you're like, okay, great, but what's Lamo? Funny story, I think it's funny, <laughs> you might not. Um, when I was a new host here, and obviously the minute I saw these, okay, so you, all my friends in the control room are getting in my ear laughing now because they know exactly where the story is going. So first of all, I saw these boots and I saw this tag and they were all suede and the inside that I could not believe and like the price points floored me and I was like, wow, now see, there's a great example of why QVC. Are you joking? But I thought they were called Lama. okay? So I remember I'm new host, I'm training, I'm learning, I'm getting calls that I'm calling this brand entirely by its wrong name. Now, fast forward. It's one of my favorite things that we do here at QVC. And yet, let's be clear, they are not just at QVC. I'm gonna take you through the colors and the choices, but this brand is based in California. They're known for sheepskin boots and moccasins. They've been around since 1995. That's the year I graduated college. And guess what? It was 1970-ish when this whole trend of sheepskin boots started getting really popular with, of all people, surfers. And now this is the quality plus the price that makes these killer. Okay, you are gonna choose whether you want a tall or a short. Tall or short. Tall has been very popular. It stands at 10 inches tall. Each has a zipper on the inside to get into these, so don't worry about the calf uh, width. But with the tall, we brought in at 10 inches tie, tall, 40,000 of these, 7,000 left across all colors. They all have a twill grosgrain ribbon kind of detail down the back, which is not adjustable, it's just for show. That's the tall. And that's the real functioning zipper that uh, since the last TSV, which was two years ago for this brand, you guys asked for. Then the short, which is equally as darling and candidly with easy pay, you might even get one of each. The short is about six inches tall. And honestly, again, would not miss this chance because these are all suede for way less than 50 bucks. Chestnut in the tall or the short, but we are really limited in the tall. 200 remain there, and then that's all she wrote. Now, the next one that we have here is what we call our navy. And I'm just gonna say navy. All of these, they have the same color sole as the suede upper, but you will notice that the chestnut was the only one that has the ivory faux fur. The rest also are dyed to match the suede and the sole. Then navy in short or tall, black in short or tall, very popular. My friend Alana here who's working behind the cameras just got hers in what size, 10? Eight. Eight, sorry. Um, okay, here's charcoal gray. Charcoal gray, love her. Um, I can't even tell you how plush that is in there and it coats the entire shaft, stem to stern, toe to tip, heel and all. And then lastly, I'm wearing these in the short. I think they're awesome, and it was a new color this year for the brand. This is the burgundy. It is fantastic. These are the short. These are only here at QVC. They're completely new as of today. They also are available on Easy Pay, so you're getting them home for like between six and eight bucks plus. Not to mention, they are water and stain resistant. So wear and tear, wear and tear, wear these puppies out. And by the way, here is, this is conservatively speaking, what we'd be retailing these for anywhere else if we price shopped something similar. Now I say conservative because I'm pretty sure we all know the brand that um, this style of boot, I think kind of um, became famous um, thanks to, and those can go for triple digits. Those are typically not the brand that you're buying multiple colors in. Those are the ones that you're thinking, what color do I want? And I've got to really stick to that color and will it be a color I get enough wear out of because I'm paying 150 bucks for this boot. As you look at Suzanne and Sue, um, these are called the Adele. They've got a memory foam insole footbed. I love the burgundy and I also love the ribbon detail on back. 
there is like a femininity and a girliness to them, but then that Austrian faux fur cuff that comes over that you haven't always seen us do, whether it's the tall or the short style, you get that big muff of a cuff that comes around um, the top lip of the, of the shaft that's just so dense and thick, you just wanna grab it and sink your fingers into it. Um, let me just take you on a little tour back here, but I also have not made clear. It occurs to me that at the beginning of this presentation, I said I was gonna organize my thoughts. I'm self-aware enough to know that nothing thus far in the past five minutes we've been together with this TSV has felt organized. So let me tell you about sizing, whole sizes only. So if you are an eight, great. If you're an eight and a half, you want a nine. I also will say, given the density of the faux fur, which is oh. dense. It's why these are typically a fan favorite and always something that people say, oh yeah, like half the time I don't even need to wear a sock. It's ridiculous. It's like Dennis Basso coating the inside of the boot and even the insole, which you can't really see, but trust me, down there is all faux fur as well. Um, but because of that, you know, let me just kind of sort of illustrate here. I am wearing a muckluck cabin sock and I am still a thousand percent able to fit into my true size, which is a nine. So under no circumstances do I think that you need to size up if you plan on wearing chubby socks with these. However, holiday return policy and free exchanges if you or they feel um, that, they, that they're too snug, but they are amazing. And then I wanna show you too, it's not just the cute factor on the outside, they're all suede, all suede water and stain resistant suede and obviously this is the only one of its kind this year this tsv and this is now your final 13 or 14 minutes i would totally snag these because they are an example of they're super cute they're totally kind of trend timely i know people that wear these in summer with bare legs and shorts I will tell you that I've had conversations with Lori Goldstein and Isaac, both of whom wear sheepskin boots when they're in their downtime all the time. And I'm going to show you what you don't have to worry about when it comes to these. Because water and stain resistant, I so wish you could feel. When you put your hand in there, the thickness of the faux fur, it goes all the way down to the toe. I've literally sunken my fingernails into the insole right now and I'm petting it. Okay, so. This is just water, but think it could be soda or it could be muddy water or something grosser. Water and stain resistant means don't worry about suede. Don't worry about wearing these when the weather is yucky. They are wildly lightweight, by the way, so I think you will want to lean into wearing these and slipping them on all the time in winter. I will just tell you that um, in winter, when I'm not wearing like a fancy snow boot, I am always in my sheepskin boots and with leggings, with sweatpants. I'm just gonna slip on the tall one here so you can help kind of visualize the difference. And we're getting a lot of questions about um, the ribbon in the back. The ribbon is just for show. There's no adjusting, no tying, and there's also no way it can come untied. This is completely glued and tacked down. So there's nothing that like, as you wear them, it's gonna fall apart. Um, I'm also gonna, oh, look at that. <laughs> it's so good, it's just so good. That right there is not 49 bucks, come on. And I'll tell you right there, that their, their, um, their logo, if you go to their website, because they're based in California, and you know, it's that whole New Zealand, Australian, unisex sheepskin boot thing. Um, but if you go onto their website, their logo is a baby sheep. It's like the cutest little baby lamb. I'm just putting these on so you can kind of maybe visually shop and decide. I definitely think the burgundy um, have to be a consideration. And you know, here again are the colors because you either have the short, which could be like a slipper boot, could be a boot boot. I actually would probably lean into getting two pairs because with this price, this is the kind of brand where you can and the other one you can't. All right. now. Navy is one color. Everything sole, faux fur, dyed to match. Chestnut, only one that has dyed to match sole, but contrasting ribbon and faux fur. 
All of these short or tall, six inches or 10 inches in shaft have the interior zipper. So don't worry about having to slip them on past um, athletic calves. There's black. This is charcoal gray and then the brand new burgundy and then up top same deal but this is the taller so by comparison the taller and as we go to the girls um, sizes once again are completely whole only there's no halvesies you also don't have to worry about sizing extra up to accommodate socks whole sizes if you're a nine and a half just get a ten I'm a nine and I'm wearing a nine with a cabin sock, so completely fine. Um, the value on the screen, I mean, I think we all know what sheepskin boots like this can go for, but here on the Today Special Value line, $39 for the short and $49 for the tall. I mean, I remember the first time presenting Lamo, and it was not just that I completely um, <laughs> Um, train wrecked the, the pronunciation of their brand but it was that I remember thinking wait that's an all suede boot and it's not even 50 bucks and so needless to say this is a brand that is slaying it at retail yes they're available other places in fact if you go on their website you'll see since they're based in Southern California they have a lot of um, partnerships, giveaways, and kind of like visibility on some of the entertainment shows that are taped out there in, in Southern California. So like they're on extra a lot. You see them being worn by um, stars in like soap magazine. And so it's a really cute brand, but it, it answers the question, how do I get that look and how do I get it in suede, but not have to commit like 150 or 250 bucks to it. And they feel I'm going to say not even identical. I personally would say these feel better than the more expensive cousins in like other brand names because the faux fur lining the whole boot, the footbed, the shaft, there's memory foam in there, um, water and stain resistant. So, I mean, don't walk through Lake Geneva in them, but yes, please like wear them in the snow. We're closing in on um, 80,000 of these since we started making these available. And since it's our only Lamo Today Special Value of the Year, um, I'm gonna have to give you an update. Chestnut in the tall. We have sizes 11 and 12 only, 150 remain. There is no advanced order. This is all we have, and that is all suede. All weather, water, stain treated suede. Um, this is navy. Again, tall and short, but you know at this point in the day, seven minutes left, final presentation. We are limited, limited, limited. Black is what my friend Alana, Alana, would you like to come on over here and just share with everybody your cute little self? This is charcoal gray. I think the burgundy, which was new this year to the brand, oh, look at the bow, is so cute. And sidebar, it's not just the bow, it's like the grommets and that it almost gives that look of lacing up a shoe, which is just, it's a little like, it's a little fashiony, trendy, cutie, but not too much of any of those. And um, whole sizes only. Also, I just have to say, I, I know I'm wearing them with pajamas, but I know a lot of people that use these both as slipper shoes and slipper boots. I'm also showing you each size. I like that you have both on. That helps, Sean. That's nice I'm of like, you. I'm shopping. <laughs> that's nice of you to say. I stole it from Courtney earlier because I saw her doing it, and I was like, Great idea. that's really helpful. Because yes, that's what we do. Right? I'm totally doing that. Completely. Um, I appreciate it. I'm also going to say, like, I'm 5'5", five five, so I don't know if that's helpful or just a piece of benign information. Mm -hmm. Suzanne, how tall are you? 5'8". Sue, how tall are you? 5'9". Five 5'9". Five and, um, I mean, I... I just feel like these are easy, they're lightweight, they're suede, they're super lush on the inside, they're incredibly comfortable. And this is how, if you live in a climate where it gets at all chilly outside or gross in terms of weather, like this is how I go out in winter. This in a legging, this in a jegging, this in a Peace Love World sweatpant. I'll never forget the time that do you guys know Kalina Gundel from Breezy's? 
who is gorgeous and she's always dressed to the nines. By extension, when I'm not at work, I try to get away with wearing sweatpants and or pajamas anywhere. 